Paul Rogers' house. I had to pick up a sound mixer and a, <laughs> a entire computer from him. So today, I'm, I'm working for a guy named Wade Bowen. He's a country artist from Texas. And I have a few jobs. I have to uh, live track the show, so I'm recording every individual channel's audio to be mixed uh, for a future release or whatever they want to use it for. And I'm also filming the show. So me and my brother Jared are going to show it with the red, a couple of Sonys, and we're going to film the entire thing. So kind of a lot of pressure as far as the media side of things of the show today. But it's 11 a.m. and I have a meeting at a recording studio in New Braunfels. It's going to be a busy day. Let's get, uh, let's get going. How's it going, man? Good, it's good to see you. Meeting at the recording studio went really well. Excited to work with them. Um, so the, what I'm shooting tonight is a live performance of a country band, basically. And it's a very dark room. It's called Green Hall. It's in New Braunfels, Texas. It's a pretty famous dance hall, actually. But it's very dark. And so I'm going to be using the Sodies because they're great in low light. But I'm also using the red. So I'm going to show you kind of how I build out the the red to, um, to be handheld and to record live music. And also show you the Sony setup I'm going to be using along with the lenses, microphones, um, and kind of just everything I'm going to take. Let me, I'm going to break it down for you. All right, the red. This is the red I'm going to be using. Helium 8K sensor. This is a great, great camera. I've used it on a bunch of different projects you guys have seen. We're going to build it out today for this uh, live shoot. This camera already has the plate on bottom that has the quarter inch rod inputs that I'll use for the matte box, but I'll get back to that. I usually use one handle. Get these bad boys on nice and tight because you don't want to drop a red. Okay, next, the monitor. LCD panel screws right on top. Okay, we need a really big, really expensive battery. And we need a really big, really expensive memory card. Last but not least, lens. And now phase one is complete. We're not done. This is an ICANN Tilter Rig. Uh, I love this matte box and the follow focus rig. It actually has a shoulder rig that, that goes with it. Uh, I'm not going to be using that. Okay, so why it's a good idea to use the Rokinon lenses. So built onto the Rokinon lenses are the teeth for pulling focus and for your f-stop. I'll just push the follow focus ring up against the teeth of the lens. Tighten it down. Now I have a follow focus. Okay, last but not least, lens cap off. Close up our matte box. And, and we're ready to shoot Wade Bowen with red. Looks pretty beefy. It's super heavy. So that's how I build up the red and how I'm going to be using it tonight to film Wade at a live show. Um, I'm also going to be using a Sony a7R 3 and a Sony a7S II. Uh, I have a few different Sony E-mount lenses I'll be using. I'm using the a7R 3 on an 18 millimeter, the Zeiss 18 millimeter to record this. So I can't really show you, maybe if I like pull my phone out. This is what I'm filming on and my brother Jared is going to be filming on this rig tonight, it's got a small HD monitor, the microphone, 18 millimeter, and the A7R 3 Back to that. So, Jared is going to be using this as well as the A7S2. Um, we also have, well, let me show you. So here's what else we're going to be using. Jared's also going to be using the Sony A7S2. I'll be bringing the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema camera. This is the uh, Sony Zeiss 24-70 f2.8 zoom. And this is a uh, G-Series 85mm f1.4. This is a badass lens. Also, quick side note, I've built out my desk to be my new, like, unboxing kind of location. It looks, I think it looks pretty fancy. So that's what it's gonna look like when I'm unboxing. That right there, 
This is the first video I'm gonna unbox, my official unboxing, my first official unboxing video. This is the Moment Anamorphic Lens. They made these for the iPhone. It comes with a charging case and the lens. And it's the first thing I've ever had of its kind, uh, any kind of lens for an iPhone. The fact that it's anamorphic is really exciting. I was one of the first Kickstarter backers when this thing came out. And uh, I'm pretty excited to open it and see, see what happens. A lot of people have already gotten them. I haven't really seen an unboxing video yet, so it should be cool. This is coming tomorrow. So that's pretty much, uh, that's that's essentially everything we're gonna be using tonight. I'm also live tracking the audio for the whole show. So we're gonna take each individual channel coming from the band and record the audio for it. So that way we can later either send it to the record label or we ourselves can mix it, master it, and get it ready for video or promotional ads or whatever it's gonna be used for. I'll show you that when we get to Green Hall. Fast forward to Green Hall. <laughs> So, on tonight's gig, I got my boy Jamie. Jamie just got back opening his first, or doing his first stadium gig as a professional drummer opening for Leonard Skinner. Not a bad gig, not a bad gig at all. Their feet from the stage is going through this mixer behind us. And that's coming to our box. So we're recording individual channels. So that, that's that's this side of the operation. Then we're gonna go do all that stuff. We'll get to that. All right. This this is Green Hall. Our dad used to play on this stage back in the 80s. Uh, pretty neat to however many years that is later. 38 years later, uh, Jared and I having our own little gig in this building. It's pretty neat. Jeremy just finished his first job as a videographer. How are you feeling? Then, pretty good. This is the Whataburger Jordan and I used to come to after every weekend. We would play three nights in a row in Austin, and we'd have to drive all of our stuff back to New Braunfels. And once we were done with all that, it'd be like three in the morning on Saturday night, and we would be just totally out of it and zoned out, sitting in that booth over there, eating our water burger. Dude, we're back. Four years later, we're back. This is the reason for the season. I would like to say thank you to Jeremy. I don't, know, I don't even know if he's ever used a camera, but he got some sick shots. Thanks for the help. Jared, first major gig with the company. Great work. No longer am I behind the scenes. No, he's front of scenes. Okay, done with the day. Finished off the Whataburger. Thanks for your help. Great work. Bye.